gotcha! Oh, God! Oh, oh, hi! Scared the... Scared me there. The me in it! No, she You said no. to go! No. 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 She said to go! No. Oh, gosh! <laughs> yeah! Oh, man, that's not good. Yeah, man, this probably is. Yeah, they probably chipped your ass, man. Actually, uh... I yeah. Oh. Oh, it's gonna be alright. I'm just gonna go on a nice drive. I got my... ride along with me. You see, I kind of don't want to have to deal with any of the slow lanes if I get on the highway. So, I got him, I got her here. That way. I can go in the fast lanes, if need be. Hey, how you doing? Hi, officer. How are you? What? What? What is that? What's... Oh, this? This is just my ride alone. I use it for my express lanes. You... Um... Is that a person, ma'am? Uh... What? Well, it's my, uh... Thing, so that way, when I go on the highway, I can go in the express lanes and go faster. Oh, okay. I think I recognize you. I can't really see you. it. What's it look like to you, Nibbles? I don't know who that is, but uh, it, it almost looks like a maybe a mannequin with wrapped plastic. Yeah, wrapped it's a mannequin. Tape, something like that. Yeah. I I okay, take where, it where out. Where you get it, man? Uh, oh, from the prop store. The prop store? Did is that something here in town? Uh, yeah, it's kind of where I get all my props when I play my games. Okay. Like hide and seek and stuff. Okay, that's fair. Uh, well, ma'am, as interesting as that is, let me go and get your license registration insurance, please. Certainly. Here you are. It's going to be Courtney Reynolds. All right, Reynolds, that like R-E-Y? Yes. Okay. Just hang tight here, ma'am. I'm going to go ahead and look that up here and just make sure everything's good, okay? Just die first. Um, I, dude, I'm getting the idea that's, that's probably a person, bro. Yeah, I got a big whiff with that window open. Okay, yeah. That'd be wise.
All right, ma'am. So, uh, any reason for yeah. your driving today? Um, we actually saw you driving pretty reckless there uh, before we got you. Uh, no, I was uh, just like testing some stuff. Okay. I didn't mean to drive Wait. so reckless. I'm sorry. Oh, that's fine. Is your steering wheel and your steering linkage okay? Is anything like kind of loose for you? Uh, it was a little loose, but I tightened it up. Okay, that's a good deal then. Yeah. Ma'am, so, um, is there anything in your vehicle that could possibly be creating that, um, there just seems to be a stench coming from your vehicle. Is, is everything okay? I mean, yeah, you, you don't happen to have, right. like, trash in the vehicle or something like that, do you? Uh, I had trash in my vehicle. Uh, I dumped it out recently, so maybe it's the lingering stench of it. Okay, something like what, like household garbage, stuff like that? Uh, yeah, stuff like that. Okay. All right, ma'am. Uh, we apologize. They're ready to just hide up here. It's yeah, no, it's you're hard good. To, uh, yeah, I'm glad. Thank you for understanding. We appreciate that. Yeah, it's no problem. All right. Yeah, go in the hang tie for us, okay? Okay, I Shouldn't will. Shouldn't be too long. Yeah, no problem. It's it falling a little too much. Let me fix that. There we go. Fix you right up. Mm, nah, that's bad. Okay, ma'am. Listen, yeah. wait, can you step out of the vehicle for us, please? For what, officer? Because we just want to double check that everything is straightforward. You know, nothing suspicious is happening, nothing illegal is happening. Why would there be anything I'm sure illegal? You can see, I'm sure you, sure you can see how suspicious it is. It is having like a, a wrapped body in your passenger seat of the vehicle. Uh, yeah. I mean, I guess, but I just got it recently, so I haven't had time to unwrap it. Okay. Well, that's ir irrelevant, I believe is the word. So, if you could just step out for us. Don't want to, officer. Uh, it's just I had not, a bad. I'm not putting you in cuffs or anything. We just, just want you to step out so yeah. you're not messing yeah, with the body we're... anymore or anything like that. Well, it's just I had. You're not being arrested, okay? I just had a bad time with officers last time. Oh, I apologize okay. for that, but I'm. I, I don't believe we've ever met before, so mm, I'd like not to. Not you. Uh... That other one looks a little familiar. Like oh. one I recently. Oh, Maybe. Ma oh, oh. I can assure you that as of oh. right now, you won't be very placed in the handcuffs. We just want you to out of the vehicle and away from the object in the passenger seat. I don't know if your other officer wants me out of the vehicle. Yeah, if no, he man, knows that, I've, I've spoken with him. I, I just He's recognize well aware of... Okay. Yeah, he, I'm sorry We both sorry came to the decision time. that would be safe. We've got, uh, we've got someone coming down here just to double check that it is actually a mannequin because I don't think either of us are uh, qualified in that regard. Oh, oh no, I've never worked at a, uh, you know, clothing store or anything like that. I haven't even seen a mannequin that close before. Oh, I understand. All right, I'll get out. All right, we appreciate that. Let's go over here and have a All right. sit down by the wall. I'll make sure not to get behind this other officer. It might make him jumpy. Yeah, I might have to pat her down just to make sure. Uh, it's up to you if you want to do that. I'm going to double check where our rescue is. Okay. Ma'am, um, at this time, because yeah. you have this vehicle and because of the um, history, uh, do you mind if I pet you down for officer safety? Just to make sure you don't have anything on you, like, um, you know, syringes, firearms, knives, stuff like that. Oh, officer. You think I would do that again? I apologize. I, I honestly don't know. I, I appreciate the apology, ma'am, but... Do you mind turning around for me? Let me go ahead and pat you down, okay? Okay. 
All right, just so you remember, my body cam is recording audio and video. I'm just going to use the outer exterior of my hands here, uh, just so you're going to be more comfortable with the pat down, okay? All right, officer. All right, ma'am, can you get something for me real quick here? I'm trying to go ahead and get this pistol off. You're here, okay? Okay. Okay, yeah, I'm going to go and grab this, uh, this vial of the needle off you as well here. That's all right. I already used it. I mean, for other okay. purposes. Okay. All right, ma'am, if you want to just go ahead and just sit down just right here, uh, that little uh, ledge right here. Um, all right. Just taking off the sidewalk. offer at this point. So ma'am, what were you doing yeah. with that syringe? Oh, I was just using it for purposes. Okay. Uh, just um, some medicine that I gave a friend. You gave a friend? Okay. What kind of medicine would you be injecting into your friend, ma'am? Oh, just the uh, herbal kind. Kind of my own concoction for uh, sleepiness. They were having trouble okay. getting to sleep, you know? Okay. Hey there, my name is James. I'm a paramedic with San Andreas Fire Rescue. You feeling alright? Oh, I'm feeling just fine. Okay, this officer said you had uh, an empty syringe. Did you give yourself something? Oh, no, I didn't give myself anything. I gave a friend one. Uh, they were having trouble getting to sleep. Was it, was it that friend in your car there? Oh, no, that's a mannequin. Oh, okay. Uh, well, if she starts to exhibit any symptoms, let me know. I'm going to try okay. to figure out what the hell this is. Yep. Sounds good, man. I appreciate it. So, ma'am, I'm just going to ask you bluntly, okay? Yes. Is that really a mannequin? Because with your history, I'm honestly having a hard time believing it right now. I don't know what you're talking about. I think I played an innocent game of hide-and-seek with you, officer. Okay, well... I didn't do too that much. that you injected something into my neck. Um, I was actually in the hospital for three days after that. Oh, um, uh, that must have been too strong. Yeah, I, I, I would say it probably was. Uh, you probably shouldn't have injected me in the first place, to be honest with you. Oh, at least did you have a nice nap that day? No, I did not enjoy it at all. It was very painful. Well, give it a minute. No, oh, yeah. I'm sorry about yeah. that. All right, well, I appreciate that. And what's the pistol for? They said they just saw it move. Oh, They okay. just saw it move? Well, that's it weird. just moved. Is that a mannequin, or we're trying to get him out of the car right now, but... If they need immediate medical attention, you need to let us know. Oh, it's a mannequin. Probably the same one I had in my trunk before. Okay. Um. Except for the last one, uh, had a black uniform. Yeah, yeah, I, I, I kind of remember that. I don't remember it too well, but, uh... You're such just a good recollection. Yeah, you're such a good sport. I just want to thank you for taking in my box that day. Yeah, you know, the thing is, you know, you try to help the community and then all of a sudden uh, you're kidnapped. So you are welcome for the first part.
Oh, you know, I just like to have fun. Okay. Oh, I understand that, ma'am. So, once again, what is that pistol for? Oh, that pistol is for, uh, safety reasons. You know how it is. Okay, but do you understand, ma'am, that after... Oh, okay. Ma'am, yeah, go ahead and stand up for us. Stand up? You're going to stand up and turn around for me, okay? Uh, why, sh why no. should I? No. Nope. Stop, stop walking, ma'am. Stop walking. <laughs> why, officer? Ma stop. We're not. Oh, that's a little excessive. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> uh, did I really? Uh, I'm sorry. Did I give you that too many flashbacks here? No, go ahead and turn around, ma'am. Turn around for me. Alright, don't be moving away, okay? Ma'am, stop walking. Well, that's what happens when you uh -oh. don't uh, be able to walk forward to stop walking, ma'am. That hurt, but also felt a little nice. But right, I heard pretty good. You, okay? Alright. Met her lima one says it, but. All right, ma'am. Well, you know, at this time, because we do have a uh, probable cause for charges on you, uh, while we go and investigate this, I'm going to advise you of your rights, okay? Okay. All right, ma'am. So you do have the right to remain silent. Anything you say can and will be used against you in a court of law. You have the right to talk to a lawyer and have him present with you while you're being questioned. If you cannot afford to hire a lawyer, we will be appointed to represent you before any question, if you wish. You can decide at any time to exercise these rights and not answer any questions or make any statements. You understand these rights? I'll explain them to you, ma'am. I understand. All right, with these rights in mind, you wish to talk to us and answer any questions we have for you. I understand. I also still want to talk with you, officer. Okay, well, we appreciate that, ma'am. So, before I only did a regular uh, pat down for weapons, and I'm going to do a full search on you now since you are under arrest, okay? All right, officer. You don't have anything else on you, do you? Uh, maybe. Okay, well, I'm about to find out here. Okay, ma'am. What's uh, what's in this? Yeah, what is this uh, syringe? What, what's in here? Look, I think we both know what's in that syringe. Okay, it's the same thing that you uh, injected into uh, me that day. Uh, it yes, 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 it is. See, it's a really good medicine. It helps you sleep real nice and tight. I'm sure you know from personal experience. Yes, ma'am. Okay, I'm gonna go to get that off you here. Oh, all, all right. right. Hey, ma'am, I'm gonna go ahead and take your hat off you here as well. I'm gonna go ahead and put that Where'd in your you property. Put that syringe in that gun. Uh, they're actually both in the lockbox in the trunk. On, she has an actually full syringe on her as well. Here, I just found it. Oh, okay. But do you want to put that? Yep. Me. So she yeah, you want to be and all that. Yep, she's Miranda's. Okay. Um. So is that your friend? Oh, that's my friends I met. They helped me uh, load some boxes into my house. Alright, well, your friend is in significant danger of dying. Can you tell me what was in that syringe that you injected into them? Oh, it was some nice uh, concussion that really gets you knocked out, if you know what I mean. Can you be more specific than that? Oh, it's just a lot of things. I kind of mixed together. It's very strong. I'm sure... The hospital have some record of it now. 
Have, have you used this on people before? Uh, the officer so, behind me. Yeah, she actually injected into my neck before. I was in the hospital for three days after that. After she uh, kidnapped me that day with the same concoction. So, um, I don't recall exactly what was in it, but they said it was basically just a lot of ingredients that were mixed up at home from what they found, just like household supplies and whatnot. Yeah, it's okay. really do nice, I have, yeah. uh Do I have your consent to have them pull up your chart just to... To know in advance what that was. Oh, absolutely, that's fine. Okay, we got. Yeah, it's uh, gonna be uh, Brian Couch, uh, batch number one five two with LSB. Okay, I appreciate that. All right, man, I'm gonna go place you in the vehicle. Okay, do you have any questions for me? Oh, I don't, officer. Oh, it's too bad I couldn't play my second game today. And what would that be, ma'am? Oh, I was still trying to think it up with my uh, mannequin in there. Ah, uh, you were going to use it for uh, for something that was not just driving in the express lane? Uh, yeah, that too. I was I was going to definitely use it to make sure I could go fast in the express lane. And then you guys caught me. Okay, what were you planning to do with the body after that? Oh, I was going to wrap it up and maybe give it a present to someone. Who knows? Okay, is that something you've done before, is give people presents like that? Uh, you know, I haven't yet, but I thought it was going to be a good idea. Okay. And Did you maybe... have someone in mind you were going to give it to? You? Uh, yeah, there there was a person in mind. I might have, like, played, like, a riddle game with them a little bit and been like, surprise, you won. And then yeah, it would have been that, that mannequin. And... Right. Okay. That mannequin, okay. Yeah. So... <sighs> What is that mannequin's name? Oh, that mannequin's name is... Jessica. Yeah, I think Jessica, that's what okay. I remember her saying her name. I mean, the name I bought the place from. Okay. And where did you find her at? Oh, I found her uh, kind of at the side of my house. Uh, Someone was uh, definitely selling mannequins on the side of the road. Then I was like, okay. oh, I could definitely use a mannequin. You want to help inside? So uh, I carried some boxes inside with a mannequin. And and then and then now I just kind of got on the road. Okay. Uh, hey, did you have a question? Uh, just really an update. Uh, the EMS was able to grab them. They're taking them in a pillbox now. Uh, like I okay. told that officer over there, there were some empty syringes still on the floor. Any passengers? Ah, uh, I gotcha. Okay. All right. Good to know, man. We appreciate that. Yeah, absolutely. All right, okay, guys. Well, hey, thanks for responding. Away. Yeah, no worries. Okay. We're gonna go ahead and, uh, get out of you guys' hair. Uh, stay safe okay. down here. We want All right, any transport too. Uh, yeah. Did you want to get to transfer? You want us to transport you, ma'am? Uh, you can transport me. I'm fine with that. If you don't mind. Okay. Yeah, that's perfectly fine. The station's actually just right down the street here anywhere. Yeah, it's just right around the corner, but I just want to make sure you're comfortable. Oh yeah, that's not an issue. Hey, we're gonna get out of your hair. Um, just to give you an update, I did hear from Pillbox. For the time being, they were able to save that individual, so they are alive okay. at this point. Alright. I appreciate it, man. Seriously, thank you. Yep, appreciate y'all. Y'all stay safe. Did uh, your partner leave you? Yeah, I'm about to go off duty, so I'm gonna grab a cab. Okay. Uh, okay. Thank yep. you. <laughs> oh, I was go all duty, and then they're like, "Oh, by the way, can you go check on this dead body?" Like, yeah, uh, I'm not gonna yeah. Turn that okay. one down. <laughs> all right, man. Have easy. a good one. Oh, Caddy Toes here. I was gonna ask you about the. I thought it was that one. You need to do anything with the vehicle before we tow it. Uh, no, um, I do have something in the trunk. Did you already look in my vehicle? That's a good point. We did not. Oh, Let's okay. Search Don't search it.
I got nothing up uh, here. Yeah. There's a picture. Hey, that's you. Oh. Yeah. Yeah, I'm starting to feel a little sick. Okay. That's not creepy at all. At least she's going to jail. Uh, yeah. Okay. Caddy Toes here. Let's go drive her back right. to the station. Did you look in my trunk? I told you not to. Yeah, I'm gonna be honest with you. I'm feeling a little uh, nauseous after looking in there, ma'am. Oh, I'm sorry. I, th I just... I thought I'd give you a nice -na bed just in case. For what any reason. Okay. Hold on. Okay, I, I, um... I'm okay, but thank you so much for the offer. Um, is, is there any reason that there's, there's, there's pictures of me in there? Oh, uh, just because I thought it was nice. I mean, you were my first game. So I had to make sure I made it to remember it every time I opened up my trunk. Yeah. Okay. Well, oh, ma'am, they're going to be placed into evidence. You will no longer be in custody of those pictures. Oh, well, that's all right. Where's the, uh... It's right here. It is. Man, that is a lot of pursuit sound on that radio. Alright, ma'am. Go and watch your head for a moment and get you out of the car, okay? Alright. Alright, I'm gonna let you go and walk in front of me, okay? So go ahead and walk through those, uh, the door right there. I'm gonna take a left, and then another left, and go straight down those stairs, okay? All right. All right. Uh... All right. Another left, and then down the stairs. And go to take a right-hand turn here, and then another right through the doors. Through the. Go ahead and walk yep. through the double doors here. There you go. All right, ma'am. Um, so, yep, go ahead and put your back against the wall there. I'm going to go ahead and get some picture of you, okay? All right, officer. All right, go ahead and turn to your right. Okay, go ahead and turn to your left, please. All right, thank you. All right, ma'am, go ahead and... Uh, actually, let me go to boat. Oh, excuse me, I'm just trying to walk ahead of my boat. Man, it was one of those nights. Buzz through the door here. All right. All right, ma'am, after you, please. All right, I'm going to go ahead and buzz you through the cell door here. All right, you want to follow me through here? All right. All right, any cell on the right-hand side there uh, is your choosing. All right, I'll go to this one. All right, ma'am. Yep, you know the drill. Yeah. All right, ma'am. Um, it looks like we're past dinner time here, so at first we won't have a meal for you, but they will have breakfast in the morning, okay? All right, officer. Do you have any questions for me? No, I don't. You have a good night. All right. Well, I appreciate you being honest with us here in the end with everything. Um, of course, I'm an honest anywhere. person. Okay. Well, ma'am, um, I'm going to go to get those charges figured out here, and we'll update you. Uh, there'll be a uh, city jailer here to take you over to the uh, actual sheriff's department once we get done with you, okay? All right. All right, ma'am. Have a good night, okay? You as well. Thank you. I appreciate it.